not to be the one who starts straight into combat, but it seems that the raiders here have respawned outside Backstreet Apparel. Welcome everyone, thank you all for joining me. Oh, you got Piper right in the head with that one. That was actually a good shot. There we go. Now we can see the light. By the way, Bethesda actually commented on my video about changing the flashlights. That was kind of cool. Kind of one of my one of my whoa moments. So it's pretty awesome. Oh, uh, the turret that took so many shots to kill. Hello. You smack. Smack. Okay, I may have damaged myself doing that. Anywho, it's great to see you all. Hope you're all having a fantastic day, morning, evening, wherever you may be. I know we've got some people in Australia. We've got some people in America, Canada, Finland, Russia. We have quite the viewership here. It's fantastic to see you all. Anyways, uh, I just wanted to throw out a little, just a little tagline about the way I play. I haven't done a full playthrough in the history of Fallout 4. I've just spent so much time exploring. I did a few quests and I would bounce in. It's not like New Vegas where I've done complete playthroughs and completed the entire game. What does that mean though? It essentially means that uh, I'm, not, I'm not a pro player. If you're expecting to see the best of the best playing, I'm not the best player. I'm not a super skilled player at this game. I just know a lot of unmarked locations, like this little mom and pop store. They went out together. It was uh, it's quite the quite the sight. You can find a little alien in the bathtub, and be sure to actually raid you know the uh, the place below. Lots of Diamond City security are in the area. We'll be visiting firstly the police precinct. By the way, I may have to give my little brother a lift, but thankfully this isn't live. So if the phone goes, I apologize. It has to be on in case you know. Knowing me wearing this headset, I'd miss it. And then I will be back. But we're just going to continue. It'll be flawlessly easy for you. Level 26, we're now getting a whopping 50 XP for every location we discover. Ooh. Smack. I do, I do like this. I like the smack of motion. Nuclear material is usually quite difficult to gather. Here, here, here. What happened to that eyebot that we sent? Is he like miscellaneous? Where did we send him to? I keep doing that. Right, click this. From GNN. Where's GNN? Oh. Gunners News Network at the Gunners Plaza. Makes sense. I know there's... A, I say I know. I think there's a stim pack in here. Haha! -ha. We will play this. Stim pack? Skill book. Message to Rodrigo Paloma. Okay, my friend. I thought about it. And I've reached a decision on the balance job. Your cut is exactly what you deserve. Zero dollars. Zilch. You heard me right. You get nothing. Yes, you cracked the safe. And yes, we got the diamonds. But you also tripped the alarm. Mackie got pinched, and that's entirely your fault. Now, when he gets out, Mackie's gonna want your head on a platter. I'm gonna give him your share instead. I see you're getting off easy. Eddie Winter, sign it off. When I said skill book, I think it's just that, but we'll have a look at the evidence terminal anyway. So, Julian's inciting a riot. Uh, object one photo taken at scene depicting Mr. Julian standing atop an overturned vehicle. Nice. Uh, and then a defaced sports jersey saying, we beat New York. <laughs> oh, another one where the rest of them are. One's at the Natick Police, uh, one's at the South Boston, and then... Another one's missing. Obviously, we just got that there. Uh, the high public intoxication. Uh, we who two bottles of bot Button Rally bourbon <laughs> and one set of clothes taken from Mister How deemed health hazard transferred to trash. And then the next one, uh, the Unger Larceny logs. 
Uh, one purse including ID belonging to Mrs. Gwen Upton Quincy. Uh, return to Mrs. Upton. One wallet including a credit card belonging to Mr. Jeffrey Knox in the cabinet. And then uh, one wallet including ID belonging to Officer Aaron White. Uh, return to Officer White. Ah, fair enough. Could we read? Bit of edumacation. And now, speaking of edumacation, we can go over to one of my favourite places, the Boston Public Library. Now, if I go through this Welcome way... Welcome to the Boston Public Library. The library is currently closed. The library is currently closed. Right. I work here. Let me in. Please provide your six-digit... My ID number is, um, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. Welcome, Mr. Mayor. Please enjoy your visit. <laughs> got him. Anyway, there's a little, uh, overdue book I need to grab. I hear lots of shooting. It's, I know it's just behind there, but I'll make sure I get everything in this little patriotic shack. Mr. Gutsy, at least. And protect them. Oh! <laughs> About to throw the wrong thing. Ah, missile launcher. I mean, I'm carrying it. I forgot I was carrying it. I'm. How did I miss that? I think he knows I'm here now. Ah, the Dartmouth Professional Building. Tell you what, serious boost in XP we're getting now. Ooh, I didn't do much. Ah, another shot. Ooh, no. Ah, oh, they were fighting raiders, right. I thought that was Piper. I was like, no. <laughs> She's fine. We've got plenty of gear for it. Totally worth. Mm hmm. Do you know I've never really went inside this place? I was here during a unmarked location. What's that for? You know what? May as well. Honestly, I always thought this was an unmarked location. Pleasantly surprised. Found them and they do not look what? Oh, I know. I it would have been overkill to use it against a rad roach anyway. Lots of random stuff, I take it. I have debated whether this 100% playthrough should include getting all... Uh, <laughs> every single perfectly preserved pie. Might actually do it to myself, but it just takes so long in between. Uh, I'll probably have to like automate some sort of process so it can just keep clicking whilst I'm away until I do get it. And then I don't even know if that would if that would be sporting. Anyway, we'll make a wee note of that. Might even come back. So this place, this this is what counts for a marked location these days. Well, consider it cleared. Let's go back to the library. Oh no! Whoa! I swear Rust Devils are... Ow! Go away! Ha! No! Oh dear. I've run into latent towers. I'm in trouble. This is not good. Viper, I don't know where you are. I hope. I hope you're okay. <laughs> the situation here. Drink the wee purified water. Get the health up. Hopefully they all fight each other. And get ourselves a nice gold watch. I don't know who wins between the two. Oh! Oh! Here, here! Solution! My turn! Oh! Ooh! A bloody mess. Critical strike. Oh. Where? 
Where did you go? It's got spiked ends to it. Oh, you had a submachine gun. Awesome. Oh. Okay. Right. Everyone just wants to dance now. I'll dance. Don't know where they all came from, so. Well, there was the phone call. I don't have to get them anymore. Success. Still be alive. They're back. Wouldn't want to be in your shoes. Tell you what, though. <laughs> oh, come on. Think that's it. Who would have knew they would have spawned in that fast? Well, we've cleared Leighton Tower, so it would make sense for me to go in and just finish it up. Never a straightforward playthrough, is it? I always get caught into something. I know, I'm the one that walked away from the place, but I heard violence. Therefore, had to be part of it. Can you tell with that better jet? Take that. Hearing shit. Okay, there should be an upstairs to this. Uh -huh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. No, 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 the truck, the truck, the truck, the truck. Woo! Thankfully we got away from that, right? We'll have to wait for the truck to explode. I don't want to risk it. There? Could always go up this way, I suppose. Oh. Mm -hmm. I definitely didn't kill this. The jet will make you jittery. A few people over there dead as well. Not the ones hanging. I think I know who killed them. Yeah, we'll not disturb the super mutants over there. They're at the, is it the Wilson building. I think that's what that is. This way. Any way across? Not, not in the way I would need to get over. Right. Sure, let's head in. Hey. Oh, I, I fell down. What? Huh? Oh, is that I? Okay. All right. First things first. Oh! Suplexed by there, can you? Can you not? Hmm? Oh, I can still carry a good boat. Hey, who's there? Oh, there's a lot of people in here. There is a lot! What? Well, know what they say. Best save them first. Didn't mean to do that. Another synth armor. Seem to be getting very popular with the synth stuff. Right, 
Nice, that'll replenish my grenades, which is what I want. Extra cams, can't turn that down. Yes. That it? Ooh, oil canister. I'm gonna get some more oil. That would give you the idea that there's dogs in a, in this place, but doesn't seem to be any. Hey, something's out there. Piper, someone shot at us. Ah, not something. I need a bigger mag for this. Is this my... Yeah, it's a combat one. I made it a combat one. Yeah, I'll swap with this. Ah. Actually, no. ah. Oh, here. That's a well-stocked fridge. Take a few of that. Anything else around here that might be of... Is some use to us? To be honest, I didn't know this place was... So, like, vast. Me, huh? Oh? No way you followed me in here. Psycho one, too. Oh, no. And a dog. What is this? That's where I make my last stand. Catch! <laughs> yeah! No! Do you know what? I surely have a better weapon for this. <laughs> I was brilliant. What a valiant last stop. <laughs> Cornered Piper. Yeah, she was in the ground for you about there. Some of these was worth a decent amount. I might even take out three. Nice. Well, that cleared the rest of them. I wonder where they were. Ooh. Oh, we're not out of camp. I dodged just yet. Nice. Nice. Alright, well, I mean, we could use this as a vantage point to snipe some of the super mutants. Oh, does that bring you up here? So you would just be, like, what, right into the... Oh, no, the button must only work at one side? I, I would imagine so. I'm gonna head back in, make sure I covered everything, so... Let's see. Time to teach these raiders here a bit of a lesson. I'm this assuming I have to use the elevator to get to it. Oh no, I can go down the stairs. Okay, oh elevator not God. required. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Bit of them here, bit of them there. Bit of them everywhere. Brilliant. Let me see there's a wee... Ooh, something in there. Hmm. Wouldn't want to play with that. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Does seem like a fur, fur drop down there. Hmm, five ball. My lucky five ball. Fuck was that? Well, they're obviously alert to my presence. Seven missiles. I'll take that. You sure you saw something? Oh come on, clean black suit. 
a clean black suit. Nice. Nope. <laughs> also, no. Piper, I need to give you a load of this because if I pick another thing up, that's pretty much me. Let's just dispatch them here. Like someone's in through here. Got it. That appears to be it. Hey. Don't mind the clutter. Yeah, we'll give you. I'm gonna use the broad cider. That's like my, my thing. So I'll give you this for now. And the sniper, I probably don't need to take it. But when I take all the items back off her, I do need to remember to, uh, of course, take that. Why? Why? <laughs> well, Easter eggs like that are just, they're just fun. I, I love finding things like that. Ooh, can I carry it? And is it worth carrying? It is worth carrying. Okay. On words we go, Piper, into the, the depths of this place. Anything in the fridge? Yep. Nice cold Nuka Cola. I wonder. Oh, this is the Easter egg I've been told about. Well, I'll say Easter egg. Apparently, they took the jack, got really sick, and they were being like sick into the bucket. I don't know where the sick is. I'm assuming that was something that they should have had. Not some nice sweet goodies. Ah, this is us back to the bottom floor. Wonder will we find anyone now about? I hear a brilliant fusion core find. Nice. I find it amazing that this is probably one of your best sort. You know, it's where you get fusion cores or in you know fusion core generators that are still operating. But then you can find like three or four in an ammo box. Like, it seems that they should have been rare, and I know that's punishing enough, but they do seem that they should have been rare at some point. So, I, f I just find it surprising. I wonder what this is the door to. Oh, a classic. Obviously, just the front entrance have blocked it up. And I think... The only notable item in Linton Towers is, well, apart from all the raiders and loot you would get from them, plus cams, it's really the fusion core. Like, that's the only thing of note in uh, the paper survival guide. So, sweet. anything else I found was just, just a bonus. That's good. Piper like that. Piper may like it, but now she's not leveling us. Or it's not doing anything for us having her with, so yeah, let's uh let's bail. Ah, this is where it exits. Ah, makes sense. Okay. So we know the mutants are awfully close. Actually amazed at times. What? Oh, spotlight. There's a little hidden duffel bag that some of you may not know about up here. You just Whoa! I I seen that coming. Like I, I could I could see it coming. And I still let it happen. Uh Right, definitely getting the cardio up today. The blood, the heart rate is going. So yes, don't fall on that. I'm hoping. I say I'm hoping. No, I know this leads to like a nice wee secret place. We on mark location. Well, by a mark location, it's just you know this. 
Fuck, what do you mean I'm carrying too much? Come on now. My pistols are always the first to go. That's just a wee duffel bag, so can't be bad to that. And we'll see the rest of the freeway. Oh, it doesn't really continue. It says frag mine, but you know there's definitely, yeah, you can see movement. There's a few raiders uh, near the turnpike, but we'll do that all in a uh, like in one go. Can I? Do I have any? Is there a dent in that? Oh, it is dented. If they're not dented, you can get into them. Is there a death claw? Oh, there's like some nasty beast just between that. Uh, that and that. I can't see anything. So I'm assuming not. Okay. You know the drill. Was I able to fly there for a second? Weird physics. Alright. I'm gonna head back to Red Rocket here very quickly. Deposit everything. Come back. And head up the uh, good old... Oh no, this is not the station. It's the, it's the other station. Right in front of here. Also, a marked location. Loads of overdue books. From this little bookworm. I thank you for your service. Alright, Piper. Let's go offload. So I'm sorting things away and I can hear gunfire. So I know there's super mutants or rust devils or someone's attacking us. And the sentinels fighting back. So we'll see in a wee second who it is. Well, it's rust devils. So I kind of seen that one coming. They just seem to be following me everywhere. Do I, can I... It's a silly what question. I'm assuming... Oh. Oh, they're attacking my... Vision? No? Where's my... Ah, oh, there you are. I was wondering where you were. Whoa! Is that the legendary one? <laughs> it's a full Q and a knife at the end. 25% chance to disarm attackers. Ah, that's cool. No, it's going to do by the light, but it's cool. Well, I got gear. Can't complain about that. I think there was one more knocking about over this direction. It's amazing the amount of people swarmed into them with pipe pistols. Goes to show, overwhelming numbers certainly wins. That was the legendary one, right? Okay, to the library we go. If you're wondering what I'm gonna take, I'm actually going to take Cap Collector. Because I do want to get it up to uh, much more, or well, I want to get the level to at least. And I also Almost want to see if I can edit this. I see any gun not ranked two because I want a larger magazine for it. And whilst I'm at it, I'm going to also upgrade this. It does look like it's making it heavier, better. Let's see, accuracy. I'm right. Here, we don't have much lead. I know where to find loads, so I'm gonna bear that in mind. Uh, we'll definitely get on to that. Can I do anything more to you? No, I think... I think you're pretty, pretty decent Silent Knight. With the Broadsider as well. Let's go. And because, of course, everyone wants to see me use the Broadsider, we have brought along for it to help us clear Copley Station. Now, I know this place is infested. Mm. With these guys. Sound, we're gonna splatter your brain. <laughs> oh, don't have any cannonballs. Who's coming up the stairs? You humans! 
Very slow moving, isn't he? Uh, oh, I thought that would explode. Many near Gotham. I'm sure you're still blown up. Right, I do need to throw some grenades at them, and I'll probably best change it over to something else. Uh, we'll swap it this. You hit like a rad rope. Ooh, that was real bad. That was nasty of you to say it like that. I hit like a rad roach. Hey, how dare you? Well, that seems to be most of Cookie Station clear. Lovely. Oh no, clean grey suit. Oh, so close. We were, we were on the cusp of greatness there and just slightly came short. It's all good though. We can... We can move on. Anything in here? Ooh, lots of new colours. We'll take all of that. And then we'll proceed into the station. I'm sure we'll find something. Hmm. <laughs> How silly is it that I can't just blast my way through them? Ooh. Clean town sit. Oh, you're teasing me, Bethesda. You're teasing me, and I don't like it. <laughs> Come on, now, uh, clean black suit. That's all we're asking here. Tuxedo. Come on, it's so close. Subway took him. Well, we probably needed one at some point. Suitcases. Do you have anything? The suitcases. Traitors. Ah, oh, they had a wee base here, it seems. Before the super mutants obviously evicted them. Or they just kind of stayed here and died. Ooh, wasn't just traitors, they were chem dealers. Got it. And all these things Piper likes. It should be someone else. So I can rank up points. Inefficient. But I did say I'm not min-maxing this game, so... Well, it's 100%, so, you know. In the long run, we know where we're ending up. Well, I could have went in the main entrance. Oh. Yay! That's a real rare thing. <laughs> Can't tell. I couldn't tell you the last time I got that good on the, uh, the luck department when it comes to them vault tech things. Imagine how peaceful, well I say peaceful, imagine how chaotic this entire place would have been when the bombs fell. Tell you what, Strong is going to be, <laughs> forgive the pun, he's going to be very strong whenever we get him. Because we've collected just so much. Hmm. You may enter, Mr. Hildenbrand. Have a nice day. Do you know what, I appreciate that they thought I might not have went through that way. So let's go. Hmm. Anything land about before we proceed? Nope. I'll tell you what. That was four grenades that I should have been able to pick up. You know what? Mr. the packer. I didn't have to. I wanted to. Bear that in mind if you're visiting. That was rough. <laughs> you want these super mutants had a hard you fight. There might still be real lions out there somewhere. I don't think there's lions in. Oh. Protect and serve. Well, this place is certainly set up quite well with the with the robots protecting it. Look at all this ammo. Right, 
Let's return them. Yep. Nice. Span tokens. Chalk. Gumdrops. Preserve sugar bombs. Huh? Actually sounds pretty good. But... What? Is it the other one I have to use? I didn't know they were that different. See if we can learn anything. Evidently not. I think this is just to show that there's a lot of terminals intact. I'm just seeing handy stuff lying about. That'll break into very nice materials. We have quite an amount. I haven't even started scrapping stuff yet. Let's see when we do that. It's going to be serious. Protect and serve. Hmm. There's a lot of robots, and I can't remember why, so either. I have to fight through a lot of these in some fashion, or we're about to get assaulted by an awful lot of scavengers or super mutants. I lean towards super mutants, but I leave it open. Protect and serve. Ooh. I will take your overdue book. Happily. But yeah, I hope you're all having a fantastic time on stream, wherever you are. Turns out a lot of these filing cabinets are, in fact, still full of lovely stuff for us to gather. Given a little tip that hot plates are definitely something I want to pick up more of as they contain circuitry and copper. Which again, we need all of. I thought there was some reason to try and get on top of these. Guess not. Okay, that way he's blocked off. We were in here. Yes, we were here. Yeah. Oh! Yoink. Is there downstairs? Oh, there is. Two levels to this. I do need the intelligence bobblehead. That's the main reason we came here today to add to our bobblehead collection. It was many a video ago when I said we were going to increase the amount. And now we can. Ooh, duct tape. What? Just in terms of random crap I'm finding? This place... This place is great! Ah. That's the main entrance. Do you know what? I'm gonna save it. Because I just have a deep suspicion something bad will probably happen in the near future. Are they all the same? Do they change? There it is! Oh, I, oh, I didn't read that in time. But I do know it's giving me permanent limb damage for a bit, so that is awesome. That's antique globes. Protect and serve. Ooh. Protect and serve. Don't know who Jalen is, but his stuff greatly appreciated. Curator Givens. Given the, uh, I'm given, or I'm expecting these are the people that set up all the protectrons. A lot of nifty toys in here. Yes. Woohoo! Permanently by one. Hank, you will take that all day, every day.
Master Lock. Oh! Okay, right, well, that's. So we know it's like. Yes! Got it. Oh man. My oh my. Look at that. Awesome. Hi, Take a look. Just in the midst of all this, I need to give you everything. Right, I'll go over to the junk. That'll do. Right. Side. Order has Crap. More? A lot of you do a bit of the, the work here. Tell you what, I ain't gonna have to come back for the amount of loot here. So I can leave at any point here, so I don't really know, I don't know what this is leading to. Regardless, XP is XP, and we've got security breach neutralized. Here, tell you what, though, oh, some amount of fighting. You know what, we'll take everything we can, Piper. Everything. Make sure any fallen robots we also scrap. Definitely one of the largest amounts of super mutants I've ever fought in this series so far. Whoa, what was that? It was legendary? Class. See, if you all recall, I didn't take out the tripwire because I knew that they would trigger the the explosive there. From my video where I had to get the intelligence bobblehead, you had to learn that these guys decide to just show up. I just about take it. Well, that was something. 
Oh. Oh. That would have been nice to know. It's getting more and more difficult, but we were able to get a hold of a few more books today. While I was scanning them in, I heard, overheard Dallin telling Shelby that we should just compress the archives now and get out of here. I thought about smacking him upside his fucking head, but I don't blame him for wanting to cut and run. It's been tough and we've lost so many, but it's all worth it, right? I mean, if we don't protect the knowledge in these machines, who will? I told them they could leave whenever they wanted to. I'm not going to force them to stay. If they don't believe in what they're doing here, then it's better they just get out of our way. If we don't collect everything, then what's the point? We've lost a few more, including Shelby. She will be missed, but I know she wouldn't have it any other way. What we're doing here is important. There are lots of books left. This knowledge will help future generations. It's up to us to keep pressing on. I can't keep the bots repaired anymore. The mutants are hitting us at least once a day. Unless we get help, it's only a matter of time before they wipe us out completely. This may be the last log I write. If it is, all I ask is the person reading this does the right thing. Help us protect the information stored in the computers in the data room. The key to the storage room is behind you. There are some supplies you may find useful. Please, only use them if you're going to further our cause. And we can like deactivate them and deactivate the Patactrons. But obviously, it doesn't matter at this point, because we've already done it. Alright, clean black suit. Clean black suit. Boo. Clean black suit. Nice. Yeah. Don't really need any of that. We'll take the hot pot. No, I'm carrying too much. There's probably some silly things I could drop. Not the minigun. No. I'm gonna drop some of them. Wonder who Shelby is. We didn't find a body. A, a body of someone called Shelby? Not to overdue books though. Uh, shotgun shells. We'll take, we'll take them. What can I, what can I say? Pres preservation of humanity and all that. Isn't so many of these have shotgun shells in them? So now that we've had time to peacefully explore everything, my main question is: Was there a quest or anything? Or is this it? I, would I kill the robots if I wanted to? I would never normally use console commands because I want this to be completely vanilla. But I think you should definitely see this. So, inside this room where we found the intelligence bobblehead, there was some cut content. See, if we glitch right through the walls here, there is a hidden terminal. The Boston Public Library mainframe. Attempting to use it will bring up some sort of compressed data to holotape. And then you get some XP for it. And I'm guessing it was supposed to be, again, a cut quest. I'm going to reload because I don't want to take the XP from doing this, but... You know, because... I well, suppose the XP technically was part of defending it. Anyway. And upon reloading, we can see that... For some reason, that was just cut. Cut from the game. Which is terrible. Uh, yeah. I, I, don't, I don't understand. It seems like this place should have obviously had a mission. Even if the mainframe, like the moment you compressed it, the super mutant started the attack would make more sense. It's odd. But, look, end of the day, we got what we came for. Let's head on over in the direction of good neighbor, shall we? This is one of the legendaries we picked up, by the way. Blazing Super Sledge. 25% deal, 20, 50 fire damage on a successful block. Eh, it's all right. Probably never gonna use it though. They did not spawn back again at Backstreet Apparel. They did. Well, they could have at least restocked the missile launcher. Guess you learned your lesson. <laughs> oh, a cam box. Never seen that before. And you. Dying for the third time in this series. Dead. Okay. So.
So, here's the plan. I'm going to go to Good Neighbor and hopefully recruit the services of McCready. Need to chat to people and whatnot. But I've never had McCready as a... I don't even think I've spoken to McCready. Because um, I was looking through potential people to recruit and... Oh! We got Mark location. The Holy Mission Church. Ooh. Eerie. Ooh. We already know that there's going to be some fun shenanigans in here. Not a gold watch, you. though. Don't worry, we'll have the level two, or we'll have the next level soon enough. And then, of course, we will happily get gun nut level two, because I would like to upgrade this weapon. It's a pretty, it's a pretty good weapon, and I would like it upgraded. Aha! Economy wonder glue. Worth it. Anything in here? Nope. This is wherever these people decided to spend their last moments. Eh, fair enough. Okay. Now, this Esplanade is quite dangerous because we've got Shelly's on the right. We've got Raiders everywhere too. Ah, crap. I'll have to do a wee bit of a gauntlet run here because I don't particularly want to discover anything. Piper! Actually, you almost out of ammo for this. Act, you know what? Alright, Raiders, you, you, are, you are getting it. The audience demands blood! I'm here to please. Alright, save. And then. Damn, I could do this all day. Oh! Where's the other one? Okay, now that I have the high ground, it's over, Anakin. Nicer. I raid their little camp here. Another unmarked location. The Raider Barricades. Haha! Alright, we'll have to swap from this weapon to something else going forward. Silent Knight's back up to 200 ammo. I mean, that could score us a couple of kills. Uh, we want to go over there, which means just a quick. Quick drop down. Come on, Piper. No rest for the wicked here. There is so much to be found. Actually, did an episode in all the way unmarked locations just with set within the espionage early area. There's uh, there's actually quite a few. Eighteen of them, I think. Well, it seems someone had their own wee, wee setup up here. That's just loads of junk items, but you know. And turn up your nose at some junk items. See, that's, I don't know how far I could drop down without getting like severely injured. So I just think, bye bye. Serious? Serious? I should just drop down. I'm going to. There we go. Okay, so we know that there's Marlborough House again, another unmarked location, oh, and oh. I forgot about you! Akasa Lonely. Ooh, Super Mutant! Lonely. Lonely being the key word. What does a lonely Super Mutant have? Of course he's got a rock lock. Of course he would nearly kill me. Yeah, he's normally pulled up here. It's just the one, though. So, you know. Take that as a win. 35 stim packs. Ah, a little ambush, is it? Okay. I'm down.
Well, we picked up the Wasteland Survival Guide to get more. So, why not? I don't know about these guys. I, I have no good memory of them. <clears throat> Welcome, neighbor. We're always glad to see a new face uh -huh. around here. Tell me something. You ever feel like this whole world is broken? Do you ever wonder why things can't be the way they were in the good old days? Why do you ask? Because if you are that kind of person, you've come to the right place, neighbor. We call ourselves the Pillars of the Community. We're a pretty new movement, so you may not have heard of us. But we're growing fast all across the Commonwealth, and you can be part of this exciting future. Step right this way, and I'll be happy to tell you all about our movement and how you can be a part of it. Sounds good. Well, that's just fantastic. <laughs> I know you're going to fit right in. I'm always excited to welcome a new member into our fold. Do I follow? Right this way, neighbor. Hold on here. <laughs> you know what? I don't know what's going to happen, so I think it's best I just pull out. When did I swap my shotgun out? When did that happen? Might be a while to the next show. Hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow it. Is this a quest? Is this being marked as a quest? Is it no? Sturges Abbott nah. Don't worry. I don't fight. It's a cult, like, I can see the smile off. So, let's see. Alrighty. I hope you're as excited as I am. This is one of my favorite parts of the job. Getting to welcome new members into our movement. The first step is simple. You have to learn to give up your attachment to material possessions in order to gain the ability to have true wealth, health, and happiness. Just go ahead and give me everything you own. And I'll initiate you as a first-level pillar <laughs> of the community. Uh, call me paranoid, but this screams trap. Right? I'm not gonna lie. You've got to be kidding. You want me to give you everything I have? The first step is the hardest, neighbor. But it's the only way to cast off your old life and start on the road towards your future health, wealth, and happiness. This is what a scam looks like, everyone. In case you don't know, sacrifice. if it's too good to be true... It's too good. What do I get in return for giving you everything I own? You're still stuck in old thinking. You're still clinging to your old life. But that's what you came here to give up. And the first step is to shed yourself of your material possessions. Can I just threaten them? I'm walking out of here. Your choice what you want to do about it. Ah, you're not worth the trouble. Plenty of easier marks. Get <laughs> out of here before I change my mind. Hmm. Scam. What's in the room? How long? I'm gonna save before I go into the room. Can I like bypass him? You'll be hidden in a second. Where do you see? Like a chameleon. I'm indetectable. He is going to actually look away from me in a second. No way. No way that worked. This is like Skyrim when you put the thing basket over someone's head. Sweet. Shoes off in here. He's a threat to the community. Kill him. What? Nah. Damn it. Do you know what? Wasn't even worth it. Workers, uh, <laughs> there was Piper about to do that. Let's get out of here. Actually, I hope you decide to become one of the. Uh, 
little on Mark safe, I'll take that, hey ye. I was here. Gosh, many, many episodes ago of the Unmark series. Okay. I know there's loads of raiders. Here. Ah, crap. That's not. Like, I don't want to fight. Honestly, I just want to get the good neighbor. Can someone, can someone just point me in the direction? This way. Damn it. It's over here. Nothing. Okay, the mongrel ran at me. Well, I hope nothing deadly appears. Ugh. Ugh. Um. Um. Shh. Hi, Dave. Leave me alone. I wonder how easy these will be able to. I just, I just need to get by this. Ah, violence, 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 right? Honestly, I, I do want to kill them, so I'm going to turn around. Sorry, old guy. Honestly, didn't want to bring you into this. Intruder. Oh, it's right there. What? <laughs> oh, no! No, 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 no! Oh crap, 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 crap. Him down. He took him down. So I can take you down. Stop moving, stupid man. That was a real. That was a messy one, wasn't it? Come on, Piper. Stab. Well, now that we cleared this little gantry playground. Location, not actually... If you enter some sort of... It's a really complicated command line. You can actually get up the icon of places that they didn't yes. include in the city. Obviously for clutter reasons. Um, um, that is one of them. Basically, can't carry anything else. Noted. Uh, okay. Hmm. Oh no, I'm at the base of mass fusion. I don't want to be here. Good neighbors at the other side, right. I want to read these letters. I don't know what they're for. Yeah, I need to put all my comic books into something. Okay, ladder number one. Lars, I know there's no easy way to do this, so I'm just going to come out and say it. I'm leaving you. I know doing it by ladder makes me a coward, and I'm okay with that. I just couldn't stand being with you anymore. The way you just let everyone push you around and tell you what to do, grow a backbone. Who wants a man like that? I'm staying with Polo now. Yes, that Polo. He may be a ghoul, but at least he doesn't take crap from everyone, and he doesn't live with his mother like someone I know. Don't write back, Sharon. Joel, what the hell are you getting back? I can't believe you left this stupid thing with me. A mole rat is not a goddamn pet. It chews and everything, then craps all over the floor. This is not worth it. I don't care how much you're paying me. Get back here in 10 days, or I swear I will butcher the thing and eat it. I'm not kidding. Yeah, they just all be funny stories. Lovely. Okay, so I need to... What is this? Annoy. Oh, it's the back of Swan's Hotel. I call it Swan's Hotel. It's not really Swan's Hotel, but there's a lot of super mutants in it that I'm probably going to have to clear out. 
Violence? I need. I wish I had a shotgun. A uh, shotgun would have made this much nicer, but. I guess I can make do. Oh, they're all normal super mutants. What was that? Nice. There's a steamer trunk on the roof. Na, 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 na. I know the unmarked locations better than I know main locations. Oh. Uh, that is funny. Do I want to take any of these? Nah, can't even carry much. Oop. We'll take more explosives. Can't carry anything. Right, time to drop stupid stuff. Pipe pistols being the first thing. They get the boot. I nicknamed it Swan's Hotel. Because, if you'll believe this, I'm sure you will. It's near Swan's Hotel. It's near Swan, the big super mutant. So naturally, I thought it was a cool name. Anything else here? Doesn't seem to be much, much else in use. A death claw hand. Uh, the usual thing you'd find. Haven't encountered too many rad roaches. I'm not complaining. Don't don't mistake that for complaining. What on earth did I pick up? It's causing me to be so slow. That was a quick in and out job for we on our desk fan. I'm sure we found one during this episode, but I'm just so glad we did. Gamer is just across the way. Right this way. Woohoo! We did it! We found good neighbor. Finally. It's weird it's not discovery, huh? I guess we've gotta go inside. Ah, right. there we go. Hold up there. First time in good neighbor? You can't go walking around without insurance. Insurance? I'm still wearing them ridiculous glasses. You better back off, or you're the one who's gonna need insurance. <laughs> well, well, hey, all right. We'll just say your insurance is paid up for now, okay? someone steps through the gate the first time, they're a guest. You lay off that extortion crap. What do you care? He ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn? I said let him go. You soft, Hancock. You keep letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new mayor. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. Now, why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. Now, I know you had old Finn handled back there, but a mayor's got to make a point sometimes. You all right? Uh, uh, <laughs> I thought Hancock was like a sweet, lovely character from, like, memory. I'm fine. Thanks for taking care of him. Good. Now, don't let this incident taint your view of our little community. Good neighbors of the people, for the people. You feel me? Everyone's welcome. Good neighbor? That what you call this place? That's right. We cobbled this little neighborhood together out of the freaks and misfits that just wouldn't be accepted anywhere else. You'll see. You make enough friends here, you'll call this place home <laughs> soon enough. So long as you remember who's in charge. Well, he certainly made a point. Now me taking all of that. Ah, I can't carry much. Okay. Your lady friend there. She's the dame who writes public occurrences, right? 
Good stuff. I always did appreciate good investigative journalism. <laughs> There's Cleo. Hello. Hello. Everything here is guaranteed to injure, maim, or kill at your discretion. Except me. I only kill when I want to. There are some things that should have been companions. Cleo is obviously one. Who? What are you? I'm a woman, baby. Can't you tell? Oh, of course you are. It's just... All those metal plates. You're a robot, right? A very womanly... Robot? Designation Assaultron. Designed to provide a variety of security related tasks to the modern man. Runtime conclusion. Why work for the man when you can work for yourself? New designation. K L E O. Cleo. Fully independent small business owner. Robot enough for you, smooth talker. Now what are you buying? Your an assaultron? That's what my maker has called me. But as far as I'm concerned, I'm a woman. And I run a store that sells very large guns. So what'll it be? Let's see what you've got. Each weapon tested on someone who deserved it. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure Cleo must have, like, unique ones. Oh, uh, there's one at the past there. Plasma. I haven't actually seen... Ooh. I haven't seen any plasma. I have 5,000 caps! How have I been getting all these caps? I suppose lots of quests. I haven't really. I couldn't actually tell you the last time we were talking to anyone. And I still. I still couldn't buy a missile launcher offer. Anything really good, though? Nah. Nothing, nothing crazy. Devastator chest piece. Look at that damage resistance. That's unbelievable. A pink mining helmet? I don't think I have one of them. I'll probably discover one at some point. A power armor frame. 3,000. Okay, I don't need that yet. Oh, copper, lead, and oil. Okay, well, I don't need any of them yet, but it's good to know what Cleo sells. Right, uh, what's the what is the ones I need? Oh, she sells cannonballs. And fusion sales. If I was to buy all of them, 500 caps. Nah. Cool, though. Very, very cool. Anyways. The old state house. Nope. The warehouse. Nope. Warehouse. The third reel. Discovered neon flats. Ah, uh, that's Content Creation Club. If anyone was uh, was wondering. Anywho, we'll go into the third reel. In fact, Piper? Where is Piper? Piper? Where'd you go? Where is Piper? I'm so confused. There she is. Hey. What can I do? Hey. You hungry? Hey. Please always keep me going. I think we're done for. If you're sure, I guess I'll head home. Just, uh, don't keep me waiting. Starlight driving. There we go. Let's go into the third reel. Have a chat with McCready. I did dismiss her there, didn't I? She's away. Okay, let's go. To the pub! No. Hancock says newcomers are welcome in the third rail. Go on in. <clears throat> Charlie serves the drinks. I deal with the drunks. Nice. Again, never been in the third rail. Why? Another one of you mercs looking for McCready? He's in the back room. I'm looking God, for McCready, so I was just song. Oi, we got beer. You ain't buying beer, you ain't buying Who's the singer? That is Magnolia, the flower of the third rail. Anything you want to know about her other than that is her business. Now, you're going to order. The third rail. Is this your place? What? Nah, God. Place is Hancock's. 
Charlie just keeps the floor clean and drinks dirty. <laughs> so, you're buying a wall. So Hancock's the owner? That's right. Owner and mayor of this whole bloody town. Trust me, never <laughs> get on his bad side. Oh, and, uh, stay clear of his bodyguard. So, what's your point? Hancock has a bodyguard? Yeah. Redhead with the condescending stare. Trust me, Cub, something about her ain't right. But I'll never admit saying that. I'm trying to sell to mm -hmm. What's the word around town? Well, they say there's a newcomer around here who doesn't understand that I'm a bartender. <laughs> <laughs> now, are you gonna drink? I'll take a look. Cheers to drown and solid. Uh huh. Mmm. Shipment of glass? I hadn't thought of that. It's cool to know, though. Awesome. Now that you're lit it up, I've got a proposition for you. I need a dirty boy to do some dirty, dirty work. Signs up my street. Blood on the pavement, bodies in the ground, that kind of thing. Interested? Sounds up my alley. I got a certain anonymous client who's paying top dollar for a clean-up job. Three locations. Everyone inside. No witnesses. Only catch. It's all in town. The old warehouse, so I can't use my regulars. Too noticeable. That's where you come in. The job's 200 caps. Payment after it's done. Don't worry. I'll know when it is. I'll get it done. You better. Now go. Hey, hey. Good start. It starts once more. I'll just start chatting there. Yeah. Need a place to stay? Try hotel Can't weather. say I'm surprised to find you in a dump like this, McCready. I was wondering how long it would take your bloodhounds to track me down, Winlock. It's been almost three months. Don't tell me you're getting rusty. Should we take this outside? It ain't like that. I'm just here to deliver a message. In case you forgot, I left the gunners for good. Yeah, I heard. But you're still taking jobs in the Commonwealth. That isn't going to work for us. I don't take orders from you. Not anymore. So why don't you take your girlfriend and walk out of here while you still can? What? Winlock, tell me we don't have to listen to this shit. Listen up, McCready. The only reason we haven't filled your body full of bullets is that we don't want a war with good neighbor. See, we respect other people's boundaries. We know how to play the game. It's something you never learned. Glad to have disappointed you. <laughs> you can play the tough guy all you want. But if we hear you're still operating inside gunner territory, all bets are off. You got that? You finished? Yeah. We're finished. Come on, Barnes. Hi. Here on gunner business. So back off. Hey there. Get out of my face. <laughs> they were lovely. I should have just gun them down. Look, pal. If you're preaching about the atom or looking for a friend, you've got the wrong guy. But if you need a hired gun, then maybe we can talk. So this is McCready from Little Lamplight in Fallout 3, if I'm not mistaken. He was the mayor, and he was just a child in that one. And obviously, you know, he's here. And I am happy to finally find him. Maybe. Why don't you tell me who those guys were first? couple of morons looking to climb the ladder of success by stepping on everyone else on the way up. Shouldn't be surprised, though. That's how it goes when you run with the Gunners. Never heard of the Gunners. Who are they? They're one of the biggest gangs in the Commonwealth. Got a rep for being crazy. Maybe you can never you know, join so them. Tightly wound, you think they were a cult or something? They but should have been a faction. Because the money was good, but it never fit in. That's why I made a clean break and started flying solo. Now what about you? How do I know I won't end up with a bullet in my back? All I can give you is my word. And a bunch of caps. Bunch of caps, huh? Okay, hotshot. Price is 250 caps. Up front. There's no room for bargaining. You've got a deal. Now you're speaking my language. All right, boss. You got yourself an extra gun. Lead on. Woohoo! McCready is on board. I'm not going to steal anything because I don't want this place to turn into a bloodbath. That's quite a nice wee back room. He's got a sniper rifle. 
This is going to be awesome. So, yeah. brilliant episode. We recruited McCready. Made it the good neighbor. Did the library police precinct. They even went to that Charles V. Amphitheater. Next episode, I'll be revisiting the USS Constitution without Piper this time with McCready. And then from there, we will, uh, yeah, just kind of see where the wind takes us. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, evening, everyone.